Good day everyone, I am Georgie Honora, and today we are going to tackle about Lesson 12, which is the measures of central tendency of group data. Measures of central tendency are basically the three M's, which are the mean, median, and mode. And unlike in ungrouped data, here we are going to be using a formula, and we must remember the steps so that we can determine the three M's. First one is the mean. Mean is expressed through the formula x equals the summation of fx over n, where fx is the product of frequency and class mark, and n is the total frequencies in the table. Then we have the median. The median's formula is x equals lb plus the summation of f divided by 2 minus cf divided by f times cw where the summation of f is the total frequencies or the sum of the values of the frequencies. Lb is the lower boundaries of the median class, where f is the frequency of median class, cw is a class width, and cf is the cumulative frequency before the median class. Then lastly, the mode. We all know that the mode is the highest number of values in the frequencies, where LB is again the lower boundary of the modal class, D1 is the difference between modal class and the class before it, and D2 is the difference between the modal class and the class succeeding to it or next to it. We can understand this more through the following examples. For example number 1, you have the scores of 6 to 10, 11 to 15, 16 to 20, 31 to 25, 26 to 30, and 31 to 35, with the frequencies of 2, 7, 1, 3, 4, and 5. And as you can see, there are 4 other rows for the table, and we must complete this so that we can find the 3Ms. So, we have LB, X, fx and cf so let's first find the summation of f or the sum of all the values in the frequencies so we have 22 next in finding the lb or the lower boundaries all we have to do is subtract 0 0.5 to the lowest score value so here we have 6 6 minus 0.5 is equals to 5.5. Next, 11 minus 0.5 is equals to 10.5. 16 minus 0.5 is equals to 15.5. And same goes and so forth. Next is for the x. In finding x, all we have to do is add the lowest and the highest value in the scores divided by 2. So, we have 6 and 10. 6 plus 10 is equal to 16 divided by 2. Then, we have 8. So, next. So, next is 11 minus. So, next is 11 plus 15 is equal to 26 divided by 2. So, there's 13. Same goes. Same goes and so forth. Then, for the fx, all we have to do is multiply the value of f and x it is in the table so we have 2 and so we have 2 and 8 2 times 8 is equals to 16 7 times 13 is equals to 91 18 times 1 is equals to 18 same goes and so forth then Then we must compute for the sum of the values of fx. All we have to do is add. Then we have 471. Then lastly, the cf. In finding the cf, all you have to do is add the value before the 
frequency. So, first one we have the two. Then, seven plus two is equals to nine. Nine plus one is equals to ten. Ten plus three is equals to thirteen, and so and so forth. Remember that uh, last value of the CF is the same as the total frequencies, which is twenty-two. We must remember that. So, now that we have completed the table, we can determine what are the three M's. As we all know that the mean is expressed through this formula. So, we have 471 divided by 22, then the answer is 21.41. Then, for median, we have this formula. And as you can see, we must find the value of the summation of f over 2 to determine the median class. So, 22 divided by 2 is 11. Then, next is that we must look for the value that is equal or greater than 11 in the CF row. And it must not be less than its value, which is 11. So, we have here 13. Then, 10 for CF, so that we can input it in the formula, then 3 for F, then 20.5 for the lower boundary, and for the CW, we have 5, because it is the number of values in the scores of the table. Like for the first course, we have 6 to 10, so let's count it. So we have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Then we have 5. Then now we have 20.5 plus 11 minus 10 divided by 3 times 5. And the answer is 22.17. Note that you can directly input this on your scientific calculator. Then lastly, for the mode. For mode, we have this formula. And as I have said earlier, mode is the largest value in the frequencies. So, we have 7. For D1, we must subtract the value before the mode. So, here we have 7, which is the modal class. And 2 is the number before it. So, 7 minus 2 is equals to 5. Then, for D2, we must subtract the value after the mode to the modal class. Frequency, which is one so seven minus one it is equals to six so we have now the d1 and d2 and the class width is just the same with the medians we have five so 10.5 plus five divided by five plus six times five is equals to 12.77 for example number 2, we have the scores of 20 to 29, 30 to 39, 40 to 49, 50 to 59, and 60 to 69, with the frequencies of 12, 15, 11, 1, and 13, in total of 52. Then, just like what we did before in computing for LB, we must subtract 0.5 to the lowest score value. So, here, we have 20. 20 minus 0.5. So, it is equals to 19.5. 30 minus 0.5 is equals to 29.5. Then, same goes and so forth. Next, in computing for the x, we must add the lowest and the highest value of the scores and divide it by 2. So, we have 20 and 39. 20 plus 29 is equals to 49 divided by 2. So, we have 24.5. Next is 30 plus 39 is equals to 69. Then, divided by 2. And we have 34.5. Then, same goes and so forth. Then, in Fx, we have 12 times 24.5. So, we have 294. Then, 15 times 34.5. It 
it is equals to 517.5. 11 times 44.5 is equals to 489.5. 1 times 54.5 is equals to 54.5. Then, 13 times 64.5 is equals to 838.5. Then, the summation of fx is 2,194. Then lastly, is the cf. So we have 12, 27, 38, 39, 52. So remember that the last value of cf must be the same with the summation of f. For the mean, the value of the summation of fx is 2,194, and for the n, we have 52. So, 2,194 divided by 52 is 42.19. Then, next is for the median. For the median, again, we have this formula. Then, for the value of the summation of f over 2, we have 26. Then, our median in CF now is 27. As I have said before, that the value must be equal or greater than the value that we got from the summation of F over 2. So, next is that we have 12 for CF, then we have 15 for F. And for the lower boundary, we have 29.5 and 10 for the class width. So, we have 29.5 plus 26 minus 12 divided by 15 times 10. And we have 38.83. Lastly, for the mode. For mode, again, it is expressed through this formula. The mode is 15 because it is the highest value in the frequency. Again, to compute for D1, we must subtract the value before the mode to 15. Then, we have 3. Then, again, for D2, we must subtract the value after the mode to 15. 15 is the mode. Remember that. Then we have 4. So here it is. So again, our lower boundary is 29.5. And the class width again is 10. Then we have 29.5 plus 3 divided by 3 plus 4 times 10. Then the mode is 33.79. For example number 3, we have the scores of 15 to 24. 25 to 34, 35 to 44, 45 to 54, 55 to 64, and 65 to 74. With the frequencies of 8, 1, 30, 35, 11, and 7. In total of 82. So in lower boundaries, we have 15. 15 minus 0.5 is equal to 40.5. 25 minus 0.5 is equals to 24.5. 35 minus 0.5 is equals to 34.5. Then, same goes and so forth. Next is for the x. So, we have 15 and 24. 15 plus 24 is equals to 39. Then, so, 39 divided by 2 is equals to 19.5. Next is 25 plus 34 is equals to 59. Then 59 divided by 2 is equals to 29.5. Next is 35 plus 44 is equals to 79. Then 79 divided by 2 is equals to 39.5. Then same goes and so forth. Next is for the fx, so we have 8 and 19.5, so 
8 times 90.5 is equals to 156. Next, 1 times 29.5 is equals to 29.5. The next is 30 times 39.5 is equals to 1,185. Then, same goes as over. In total of 3,749. Then lastly, for the CF, we have 8, then 9, then we have 39, then we have 64, then we have 75, then 82. So, you can see that your CF is correct when it matches the summation of frequency. For the mean, again, this is the formula. And here, we have 3,749 for the summation of fx and 82 for the n. So, 3,749 divided by 82 is equals to 45.72. Then, for the median, again, this is the formula. So, as you can see here, first, we must find the value when we compute for the summation of f over 2 first, so that we can find the other values. So, we have 82 divided by 2, then we have 41. So, we have 64. And for the cf, we have 39. And for the f, we have 25. And the lower boundary is the 44.5. And the class width is 10. So we have 44.5 plus 41 minus 39 divided by 25 times 10. So we have 45.3. Then lastly for the mode, it is expressed again through this formula. So, so we have 30 and then for D1, 30 minus 1. Then for D2, 30 minus 25. So we have this. So, as you can see, 34.5 is the lower boundary. Then, we have 34.5 plus 29 over 29.5 times 10. So, we have 43.03. For example number 4, we have the scores of 3 to 10, 11 to 18, 19 to 26, 27 to 34, 35 to 42, and 43 to 50, with the frequencies of 3, 2, 5, 12, 8, and 9, in total of 39. So in LB, we have 3. 3 minus 0.5 is equal to 2.5. 11 minus 0.5 is equal to 10.5. 19 minus 0.5 is equal to 18.5, then same goes and so forth. Then, in computing for x, we have 3 and 10. So, 3 plus 10 is equals to 13, divided by 2 equals 6.5. Next is 11 plus 18 is equals to 29, divided by 2, then it is equals to 14.5. Then, same goes and so forth. Next is for the fx. We have 3 and 6.5. 3 times 6.5 is equals to 19.5. 2 times 14.5 is equals to 29. Then, then we have this, this, this. The summation of fx is 1253.5. Then lastly for the cf, we have 3, 5, 10, 32, 30, 39. So, it matches the numbers of frequencies. For the mean, again, we have this formula. So, we have 1,253.5 and 39. So, 1,253.5 divided by 39, then we have 32.14 for the mean. 
Then next is for the median. Again, for median, we must find the value of the summation of f over 2 first so that we can find the other values. So now we have 39 divided by 2, then we have 19.5. In the CF row, we have 22 for the median class and 10 for CF and 12 for the F so that we can input it to the formula so that we can input it to the formula then the class width is 8 and the lower boundary of the median class is 26.5 then we have 26.5 plus 19.5 minus 10 over 12 times 8 and the median is 32.83 then lastly for the mode for mode, the highest value of frequencies is 12, as you can see in the table. And the lower boundary for the modal class is 26.5. Then the class width again is 8. For D1 again, we have 12 minus 5, then we have 7. And for D2, we have 12 minus 8, so we have 4. Then Then, we have 26.5 plus 7 over 7 plus 4 times 8. And our mode is 31.59. For example number 5, we have the scores of 12 to 16, 17 to 21, 22 to 26, 27 to 31, 32 to 36, and 37 to 41. With the frequencies of 3 to 5, 7, 6, and 4. In total of 27. So in LB, we have 12. So 12 minus 0.5 is equals to 11.5. 17 minus 0.5 is equals to 16.5. 22 minus 0.5 is equals to 21.5. Then same goes and so forth. So next is for the x so we have 12 and 16 so 12 plus 16 is equals to 28 28 divided by 2 is equals to 14 next is 17 and 21 so we have 17 plus 21 is equals to 38 so 38 divided by 2 is equals to 19 next is 22 and 26 22 plus 26 is equals to 48 divided by 2 and it is 24 the same goes and so forth next is for the fx next is to find the fx so we have 3 and 14 so 3 times 14 is equal to 42 2 times 19 is equal to 38 5 times 24 is equal to 120 then same goes and so forth in total of 763 and lastly for the CF so we have 3 5 10 17 23 and 27 so it matches the summation of F For the mean again, we have this formula. So, the value of the summation of fx is 763 and for the n, we have 27. So, 763 divided by 27 is 28.26. The next is for the median. For median again, we have this formula. For the value of the summation of f divided by 2, we have 13.5. Then, our median class in CF row is 17. As I have said before, that the value must be equal or greater than the value that we have, which is 13.5. So, we have 17. The next, we have 10 for the CF. Then, 7 for f. 
then 7 for F, and 26.5 for the lower boundary of the median class. So, we have 26.5 plus 13.5 minus 10 over 7 times 5, and the median is 29. Then lastly, for the mode. For mode, again, it is expressed through this formula. The mode is 7 because it is the highest value in the frequency. So, again, to compute for D1, we have 7 and 5. So, 7 minus 5 is equals to 2. Then, for D2, we have 7 and 6. Then, 7 minus 6 is equals to 1. For the lower boundary, we have 26.5. Coincidentally, the same with the median. And the class width is, again, 10. Then we have 26.5 plus 2 over 2 plus 1 times 10. And our mode is 29.83. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned a lot from this.